Hello everyone, welcome back to my next tutorial in Siemens NX. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to model this nut using Siemens NX. It has a nominal diameter of 16 and width is 8 and we just want to make a triangle thread with a standard thread. So, just model this component in NX, the model will look like this. This is the nut we have created in the Siemens NX modeling. This is the model. Now in this tutorial, we will learn how to model this nut step by step. First go to the file, new, model, units are in mm, millimeter, provide a file name, specify the location, just say ok. For easy modeling, I am just taping this right side and this figure in the left side. First, we will create this hexagon shape. For that, go to the sketch. Plane, I am just going to take a top plane. OK. Instead of creating the hexagon manually, we have a polygons. Go to the menu, insert, curve. Here you can see there is an option called polygon. Different polygons we can make it by using this. Just choose this polygon. Hexagon is a six sided. Just place it here and enlarge it. Enlarge it and place it here. Just close it. Now we need to specify the dimension from this edge to this edge. The dimension is 16. Sorry. From here to here, from this corner point to this corner point is the diameter of the hexagon. Just click this point and click this point. This one is the diameter, this one is 16, press the roller. Now we have created the hexagon with the diameter of 16. Then we will we'll create a circle. Take a circle, then place it and create a circle. This circle diameter is 8. Now we have created completely just Sketch is also fully defined. Finish the sketch. Then extrude. The total extrusion height is 8 actually. This one is 8. Make it symmetric. 8 mm. Just save ok. Now we have created hexagonal shape. Then we just want to chamber it here. This corner has to be chambered. For that how we can choose it? Make sure this vertical edges plane has to be chosen. Go to the sketch. This plane we need to choose this vertical edges plane. Just save OK. Now create a triangle. Take a line. Create a triangle here. Horizontal, vertical. Close the sketch. Press the roller to confirm. Again press the roller to confirm. Now this angle is make it 60. Save OK. Decide to make it 2.6 something or 2.5. Press the roller to confirm. Now you can see here the sketch is fully defined. Just finish the sketch. Now this uh, this sketch has to be revolved around this axis. For that use option called revolve. Now here you can see curve we have chosen. Specify the vector. The vector is this vector. From here we can choose that axis. Here you can see it is removing the material 360 degree. Subtract. Just say ok. The same has to be mirrored in the downside also. The same revolve feature you choose, 
and there is option called mirror feature we need to choose this specify the plane this plane here you can see the square box is coming here just say ok like this we can display we can control this also edit the parameter just close sketch edit sketch this is, is just specified in two, 2 just enter press the roller to confirm finish the sketch so this one is the sketch we have to change the cut just go to edit instead of this one just changing this into 45 just finish the sketch yes this is enough now we can put the thread for that just go to the menu insert here there is an option called design features under that there is an option called thread choose this thread here there is a two options one is symbolic thread another one is detailed thread we want a detailed thread select the cylindrical surface this cylindrical surface start from this top face it has taken already and uh, here thread table or manual we can go so i'm going with the manual this one is 8 major diameter is 8.5 minor diameter is also the 8 pitch i am giving uh, 0 0.75 here you can see it is updating this thread is enough to me just say ok so now we have created a knot with inner thread in this tutorial we have learned how to model the knot with inner thread in next tutorial we will come up with a new component if you like this video, please share to your friends. For more videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you.